everybody. Hey, I wanted to address a comment, uh, actually, that Rick Bradbury posted on one of my uh, videos on my new EFS 17 to 55 lens. He mentioned that uh, I should probably look into buying EF lenses instead of EFS lenses from this point forward. And, you know, the there's a good argument to be made uh, for that. For those of you who don't know, EFS lenses only fit um, the crop sensor cameras. I believe only the 1.6 crop sensor cameras, which covers pretty much every Canon DSLR from the very low range digital all the way up to the 7D. All the Rebel series um, cameras um, I believe the 7D is the highest end camera that the EFS lenses fit. The EF lenses will fit all those cameras plus the $2,500 to $6,000 uh, cameras as well. The EF lenses will fit all the cam all the digital SLRs and film cameras. So it's a good argument. Um, I, for, for uh, Rick's information, I did look into the EF uh, 24 to 70 and also the EF 20, I think it's a 24 to 105 or 28 to 105. I can't remember which. And I really agonized um, over which lens to get, but I finally landed on the EF S 17 to 55 because it had everything I wanted. Um, if you look at the um, 24 to 105 and the 24 to 70 L series lenses, the 24 to 105 um, is a constant f4 aperture, not f2.8, and the 24 to 70 doesn't have image stabilization. So this lens just had everything I was looking for at this time for this camera and I must say that it's a marvelous lens. Um, I've shot a whole bunch of video and, sh and stills with it just today and I, I can't say enough about it. The only thing uh, that I found that's maybe a little bit bothersome is the weight of it. it it's fairly uh, it's a fairly uh, weighty lens, uh, a heavy lens, but man, other than that, what a what a nice piece of glass. Oh. So anyway, I wanted to make sure that everybody understood if you're watching these videos and you're thinking about buying a lens, the EFS lenses are not going to fit your full frame bodies if you decide to go that route in the future. Um, so keep that in mind. Um, so the EF lenses um, actually perform fairly well on crop sensor cameras because you're only using the, the middle part which is usually the sharpest part of the lens. So you know the, it, it's a good idea to buy EF lenses. Um, this specific time I did get the, the EFS. It's probably the last time I will get an EF lens. EFS lens, I mean. So, uh, just wanted to get that out there to inform everybody why I made the decision, and most of all to inform you that EF lenses fit all of them, EFS lenses only fit the crop sensor cameras. So, hey, this has gone on too long. You guys have a great day. We'll talk to you soon.